Her body found between two rocks hidden by branches. Just some of the sad facts coming out today in the trial of a man accused of killing a UT freshman. Mikhail Kreiner is charged with capital murder on the killing of Hadika Weiser in 2016. He's also suspected of sexually assaulting her. KV's Molly Oak is live outside the trial right now. Molly, today we are learning more about how Weiser was killed. Mike, a homicide detective with the Austin Police Department, says some things are still very unclear, but he says he does know one thing. He thinks that Weiser didn't have a chance to survive. That's because he says she didn't show any signs of fighting for her life, like scratch marks from trying to pull the ligature from her neck. Prosecutors say that ligature was a nylon strap that was shown to the jury today, along with other pieces of evidence. The detective says that strap was so tight around her neck that he believes it put her in her attacker's control and believes that she didn't have the strength or physical ability to do anything about it, meaning he doesn't know if she was dragged across the creek bed or willingly went out of fear. He says the order of the events is unclear. However, he, the detective does believe that Weiser's body was physically carried and placed between the two boulders. He also says he believes the attacker gathered sticks from the area and put them on top of her body to try to hide it. If Kreiner is found guilty, he does face life in prison. Live in downtown Austin, Molly Oak, KVU News. Thanks so much, Molly.